DaVinci Resolve 19 is out now and the new tracker is here. This is how this shot would have been tracked with the old point tracker. For those who are not familiar, to track something, go into Fusion, you select Shift and Spacebar, look for the tracker, add it, then over here, usually it was just on point instead of the IntelliTracker. tracker. So it would have been point, you set your point for over here and you click on track forwards and backwards. It lost it almost immediately and it never recovered. But let's see how the IntelliTracker did it. It wasn't 100% accurate, but it was 99% better than the old tracker. You just have to add a tracker, remove the point tracker and then set a point. Pick a spot where the point you want to track is clear and visible. Then hit on track forwards and reverse. It wasn't flawless and of course the test footage isn't perfect. I mean, it's very shaky, but that's the point of a test. Here it kept focus on the point I had set it to. It lost it, but then came back. I still had to manually readjust a few points, but compared to the point tracker, it's quite the improvement. I hope this was helpful. Like, share, subscribe, as that's the only way this channel grows and you can check this video out next. Here's how I created this animation, all from a screenshot and within DaVinci Resolve.